Hi everybody, this is Linda, and I'm back with another D-Stash. This is Laces and Trims, and there's a couple of other little things thrown in. So, um, if you're interested in this D-Stash, it's U.S. only, PayPal only, and I'd like it deposited, friends and family, and my account is lynnparent at yahoo.com. And if you are interested in this, uh, you can email me at lynnparent at yahoo.com. Okay, so let's get started now. Okay, this is a, a very big box, as you can see. It is full, and it's a large priority box, and it's stuffed. I can't get anything else in it. And I'm asking $65 shipped. So this will be lot A. I'm going to have another box the same size. It's going to have different, different things in it, but it'll also be the same price. But I'm going to do that in a separate video because if I don't, the video is going to be way too long. So this is the first box, and we're going to call this lot A. Now, like I said in the beginning, there are a few things in here that are not laces and trims, but they're in here because after I went through my things and I picked out what I was allowed to keep, which wasn't that much, um, I found a box with this stuff in it. And so I already had these boxes ready to um, sell, so I just threw this stuff in on top. So. I just divided it between the two boxes. So this is the things that I found. These are is it's a little pack of um, flowers and bows and stuff that I'm pretty sure came from China. I'm not going to take all these out because it's I just don't have time. And uh, this is a little package of flowers and they're a peach color. They look like roses with a little ruffle around them and. Then I will take these out, this, and I'm sorry for the crinkling, but you know, these kind of bags just make a lot of noise, and uh, these, there's four of these, and they look like little rabbits, which are so cute, they'll be really cute for Easter, and they have a little bow on them, but uh, yeah, I'd probably put a little, I don't know, maybe a little ball right here, and make it look like a little Easter bunny facing backwards, I don't know, maybe. Anyway, it's just a thought. Or you could use these for eyes and put a nose in a mouth. I don't know. They, I, I don't know what they are. They just look like Easter, but they just look like bunnies to me. So anyway, goes down there. And then I found this, and this is just um, I cut this off something. I don't know what, but it has three flowers on it, right up here, and then it's got this little uh, lacy thing. I mean, not lace, but little uh, gathered ruffly thing here, which I thought was cute. And I guess I was going to do something with it, but I don't know what, because I don't even know when I found it. Like I said, it was I had all this stuff in a box that I didn't find till after I had already chosen my allotted amount that I can keep. Which I decided. My husband said, keep it all. But I'm, I can't do that. I can't. It's too much and I won't have any place to put it. And there's no, it's if I just store it in boxes in a storage unit, it won't be any good. So I might as well get rid of it. Okay, this is a big, um, I guess it's like, I guess it goes this way. And it must go on, um, it must have been on something, a a collar. I mean, a, it was a trim off of something. But anyway, I found this also. So I'm going to include it. And you can always cut it apart and use it for stuff. That's what I do. I just, I cut these things off of garments of some sort. And then I cut them apart and use them for embellishments on things. Now, these are different. And I don't know where these came from. But there is that one. And it's it's pretty, I think. And 
then there's this and I don't know I cut this off of something also but I don't know what it was but it looks like I cut it off and was going to use it for something but anyway I found it and I just thought I would throw that in just to make the box a little bit fuller than it already was which was pretty full uh, and I will say that if you think I'm asking too much you can always make me an offer. I thought it was a good uh, a good price because it cost, I think it's gone up to $17.96 to ship a large uh, priority box and when you deduct that it's really only uh, what, 40 something dollars for all this stuff which I can promise you I paid more than that for it. But of course I didn't expect I'd get my money back. Anyway, then I found these um, these cords. I thought at first it was elastic, but it's not. It's just different uh, colored uh, little corded trims. And I'll just open this and show you a few. So there, there's a lot of it there. I hope you can see it. Um, I'm trying to keep all the air out of these so they'll all fit back in that box because if they're puffed up with air, I'm not going to get them all back in. Okay, and then I found these three little flowers. There's a pink one and a multicolored one that's, and then a blue one. And there's just those, you know, fabric roses, shabby roses, whatever. Then there were these, um, I don't know where they came from, but this is an orange one, sort of oranges and pinks. And this is a pink, and it's just got a little bit of trims and flowers in it, and ribbon. And there's a couple flowers. Whoops, that one fell out. We stuck it back in there. They're not in there like they were, but. <clears throat> well, let's try this again. There we go. Okay, there's those. <clears throat> and this is a bag of collars that I found. And some of them are lace. Some of them are uh, like a satin with uh, trim around the edges. And I'm not going to take those out. Because all that was stuff that I just threw in after I was already done with these boxes. Okay, so now we'll get to the trims. Alright, some of these I'm not going to take out if I don't have to. Um, I will take this little bit out so you can take a look at it. Um, it's like a three different trims and they're all put together and there's quite a bit of this. I always liked this. I used a lot of this way back when I first got it. I don't know where it came from now. But anyway, there's that, and then there's this, and let's see what it's this. There's, uh, it's like this, and there's a few pieces of this, different size pieces. And I don't know exactly how much they are, there is in a yard, because all of these things that I'm showing you now are things that are, I do have a lot of this is measured out but I have some that's not. So, some will be measured, some will not. So there's that. This I've had for a long time and I never used it. Um, I think there's probably, I'm going to guess probably two yards of this, but I didn't measure it. Um, I got this from Shabbylicious, and I don't think she even has a store anymore. But it's it's pretty. It's got these little dangles on it, like little hearts. And I might have used a little bit of it, but I don't think so. Here's a big piece of it, big old piece. So that's in there. Okay, let's see. 
And here's some. This is four and a half yards. And I'll just take a little bit of it out so you can see what it looks like. If you can see that. And it's kind of a cream color, I think. I don't think it's white. No, it's like a cream color. But there's a lot of that. Four and a half yards. Um, the bags are pretty stuffed. <laughs> okay, then let's see what else we have here. I guess I think I cut off of something, but I'm going to throw this in. I think I cut this off of something. Pretty sure I did. But uh, I liked it. It had a lot of had a lot going on. Thought it would make a nice trim for something. So put that in. And this is pretty, and I don't know where I got this. I'm not sure how much is here. Um, I know I shared some of it with somebody, but it's really pretty. It has this, um, I don't know, I'm going to call it a dark peach because I don't really think it's orange. But it's looking orange on, on um, it's looking orange, but it's not that orange. It's, uh, it's really a pretty color. It's kind of a, maybe it's called coral. But I know it's showing up as a very yucky looking orange because I can see that from here. But it's really pretty. It's and but this this will come out anyway if you don't want it in there. You can change the ribbon. But it does have these little um, coral flowers that are in there also. Uh, but I guess you could use a green ribbon or a white ribbon or whatever you like. And I know there's a, at least a yard of this. There might be probably a little more than that. I believe I ordered either two or three yards, and I shared some with somebody. I don't remember who that was that I gave some to, but I don't think I ever used it. So there's that. And then there's uh, four one-yard pieces of this. So if I can pull a little out so you can see. This is also a, oh, this is the right side here. There's also, this is also a cream color. You see that? Okay, and then there's two pieces in here. And I know these are kind of vintage. I bought from a lady downtown that was selling a lot of stuff. Um, so that's one piece. And yeah, there was this lady and she used to have a um, shop and she sold vintage fabrics and trims and she closed her shop. And I was so excited when I found out about her yard sale. I went and uh, bought some stuff from her. This is the side here. And I think you can can um, pull this and make fringe. And then it has this little like crochet trim along the top of it. Hope you can see that. So there's that. And I don't have any idea how much is here. I didn't measure this. But... There's definitely enough for a project or two. Okay, and then there's this ruffled trim. And as you can see, there's quite a bit of this. A couple yards, I guess. And it's pleated in the middle. And then it has the lace on each side. So that's pretty. And that's white. I don't know if it's showing up white or if it's showing up cream colored. Let's see what's next. Okay. This is a, I don't know, it's kind of an ivory, pinkish kind of color. It's elastic. I love this. I used a ton of it. Um, 
on some projects in the past and I just really really like it and uh, but I didn't find it in time to save it so I can't have it now so I'll just can't have it all okay oh, let's see what else we got here okay this is one that I don't have measured but it's just a white uh, ruffled lace and this is not measured and it's a and this is like a pleated a pleated lace Ooh, that's pretty too it's real pretty and it's really soft so that's nice and this is just a little flat lace and it's got some I don't know if you can see it or not it's got a little shimmer to the middle of it I don't know if that's showing up I can't tell from here probably not so anyway I don't know how much there is of that either get a few more things out here still quite a bit to go um, hmm. I don't know where this came from. I don't think I ever opened it up. Wherever I got it. Looks kind of old. Probably about a yard. It's pretty it's thin. It's very thin. So I'm get this open back, put it back in. Oh dear, I hear somebody sh shooting a gun or something outside. That's going to make my dog go nuts in a minute. Okay, and here's a little um, eyelet trim. And here's another one. This is two different ones in this bag, and this is some of the stuff that I bought from the from that lady that had the vintage shop downtown. That's pretty. That's a little bit stiff, but I think it. I don't know if you. I guess it's supposed to be that way. And then there's another one in there that's a kind of an eyelet sort of thing. Okay. So that's those. And there's three yards of this. Get the right side. This side. I really like this. I still have some of this myself. Not as much. I just have a little, little piece. But this also came from the, from the um, vintage shop. That's really pretty. I don't know what you call it, but it's, uh, it's got these little crochet things in the middle. I don't know what they are. I'm not, I don't know about these things too much. I just know what I like when I see it and I buy it. I don't know what they're made out of or what the kind of handiwork is, handwork is called or any of that stuff. This is another one that I got from her and there's some um, seven yards of this. And it's got little flowers on it. There. So a lot of these are, you know, there's a lot in these bags. Some of them don't have as much as others, but some of them have a lot like that. Seven yards, that's a lot. This is one yard. Let's see what this is. Oh, this is pretty. This is like flowers. Can you see that? Yeah, yeah, I like that. It's pretty. I wonder why I'd ever used it. Hmm. 
I'm really bad about bringing things home and just sort of sticking them, sticking them somewhere and forgetting about them. And when I get them, I think I'm going to use them, and then I don't. I guess we all kind of do that, don't we? I don't. I'm not a hoarder, but um, in my craft room, I think I am a hoarder. But nowhere else in my house, just in here, in the craft room. So, my husband's always calling me a crafty hoarder, so I guess that's what I am. Because my room is full. I haven't even started with my uh, scrapbook stuff. I've just been going through my, uh, I started with my wedding dresses, and now I'm, uh, these are my, I'm getting rid of my trims that I can't keep. And then I'll go on to, I don't know what will be next. Anyway, this is this is pretty. And I don't know how much is here, but it looks like there's at least one to two yards. Maybe more than that. I measured a lot of stuff, but then the stuff that I found that I did not measure. The stuff that I found afterwards, I didn't measure any of that. I only measured in the beginning and after I got my stuff, I got my two boxes that I was keeping. Um, I thought I was done. I went through and I measured everything else and then and then I found that other box that had all this stuff in it. So the stuff that's not measured is the stuff that I found and I just don't have time to measure anymore. This is a pretty um, crochet piece. And there's three yards of this, and it's a, an off-white cream color. This is a flat lace, and there's three and a half yards of it. I'll try to keep the glare off so you can see it. And here's another flat lace, and this is sort of a, I don't know, kind of a buttercream color. It's not yellow, I don't think, but it's not uh, it's not a cream color either. You can see the difference there. I think it's got a, it's kind of buttery color. It's pretty. You might call it yellow, I don't know. It's dark outside because it's nighttime, and so my lighting is, is not the best. It's not that great even in the daytime, but it's really bad at night. And this is uh, another flat lace and there's five yards of this and this is a wide lace and there's three and a half yards of this I said I wasn't going to open all these but I seem to be doing it don't I that's pretty I like that I guess it would go this way It's pretty. And there's three and a half yards of that. Squeeze that air out. And there's three and a half yards of this uh, ruffled trim. Ruffled lace. Maybe we'll call it. And this is really um, a real soft one, real soft lace. I don't know what um, it's made out of, but it's it's nice. You can make flowers and stuff with this, I guess. I don't know. I'm sorry if I'm getting out of frame on some of these. I don't have my chair sitting right up to my work spot here my desk um, I have some boxes in in the way so I'm sort of sitting at an angle from my camera there's five yards of this um, that's another uh, flat lace and there's two and a half yards of this one and it's a flat lace but it's kind of got a scallop at the bottom of it I guess you call it scalloped bottom Let's see. Kind of like that. 
and it's soft too. You know, some laces are kind of stiff and some are, some are soft. This one's a soft one. I don't like the stiff ones too good, but um, I use them sometimes. It just depends on what I'm doing. There's still quite a bit down in here. Okay, there's four yards of this, and I don't really know what kind of lace you call this. I call it crochet lace, but it's not really. It's not really crochet. It, it might be, but it's it's not hand crochet. I know. Um, anyway, there's um, what did I say? Four yards of this. Let's see, there's one and a half yards of this. And you know, I'm sorry for all that crinkling, but I do want you to see what you're what you're getting if you're interested in buying it. I want you to know what you're getting. So here's a dangle trim. This is a really pretty one, I think. There you go. And there's one and a half yards of this. There's two and a half yards of each of these, and they're flat lace, that crochet kind of stuff I was showed you a few minutes ago. And there's one and a half yards. Ah, that's the same one. So you're getting two and a half yards of that one, and then you're getting one and a half yards in this one. So those the white is the same. So there's lots of that. And then let's see. Oh, here's a little roll of uh fringy stuff that I know came from Michaels. So you get that. I never used it. And this is a nice crocheted uh, piece of lace here. Looks like it's got little hearts on it, on it there. And two yards of that. Come on, squeeze the air out. There's two yards of this. Let's see what this is. Um, now this is one of those kind of stiff ones. They're okay, but I don't like them as well. But there's that's what that looks like. And it's there's two yards of it. Then there's seven yards of this trim in here. Hmm. It doesn't look like seven, but I measured it. It's thin though, like that. Anyway, there's supposed to be seven yards in here. And you know, they're not going to be exact. There might be a little more or a little less, but they're right around whatever it is I have on the bag. This is two yards, two one yard pieces in here, in here. So I'll just take one out and show you what that looks like. So that's about that big. And so there's two of those. I'm starting to see the bottom of the box. There's six yards of this, this small little white lace here. And there's one yard of this. Can you see that? Let me just take it out and show you. One yard of that. You know, moving is so hard, and I haven't even started the house yet. I had to get all this done first. This is my worst thing to do. It's my craft room. 
especially since I'm not keeping everything. Okay, this is uh, really, I, I like this. I don't know where it came from, but there's three yards of it, and it's really, really pretty. I can't tell. I think this is the, um, this is the right side here. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it's really pretty, and it's really soft. I really like it. So there's that. And then there's uh, one yard of this, and this is uh, a wide dangle trim. Real wide. I said there was one yard. Let me see. Yeah, here's the, that's not, I guess altogether it's one yard. And this, I think I probably cut off of something. So there's that. I'm not a big fan of that dangles that are that long. I don't make things that have dangles on that long, but I see some beautiful things that some other ladies make, and they use those big long dangles like that. Okay, there's two and a half yards of this. Let's say, no, it's two one yard pieces. Well, it's still two yards, but it's in two pieces. Let me show you this. That's pretty. Could cut those flowers out and use them on something. I knew this was going to be long. And the next one will be the same. It'll be just as long because it's got the box has just as much stuff in it. It's just most of it's it's got different stuff in it, but it's similar to this stuff here. Ooh, my floor is full. Okay, and this has one yard of uh, crochet trim. There's one and a half yards of this one. And this is a flat crochet trim. And this is not crocheted. I don't know what you call this. Um, it's lace, I mean, it's, but it's, it's not crocheted, it's, you know, something else. I don't know what this is. Anyway, there's a yard of this, and if anyone knows what you call this, I would love to know, because I don't know. All right, and then... There's this one. There's five yards of this crochet trim. There is five yards of this crochet trim. There is two and a half yards of this crochet trim. And there is two and a half yards of this flat lace. And then there is, and I don't have any idea how much there's on this thing. It's an eyelet ruffle trim. Um, it says 24 yards. Um, I don't know where I got this. Might have been a thrift store. But um, it says there's 24 yards. Whether or not any of it's been used, I don't know. You can see that these are pretty... Thick. This is a pretty thick thing here. It doesn't look like very much has been used on it. So anyway, it's a lot. So you'll get this eyelet trim here. So that is it for this box. And like I said before, please send me an email. And I'll put the information down below. But I'd like... Um, $65 and please say that it's lot A because I have another box that's going to be coming up. I don't know. I might not get it up till tomorrow. I'm not sure. Just depends. Um, but anyway, if you're interested in this one, it's US only, PayPal only, um, deposit friends and family. 
My account is lynnparent at yahoo.com, and that is also my email address. So thank you for st spending all this time watching this uh, D-Stash, and uh, yeah, I guess that's it. I need to go and get something to drink. I'm thirsty now. Okay, so thanks for stopping by, and um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye for now.